Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks, and here I'm looking at the Spectre X360. This is a 13.3 inch notebook, and if it looks familiar, well, it's because it is identical to the X360 that I have been using all of late last year. The main difference is, is that it changes color, and well, if you see the one up top, that's an LCD display, that's an OLED display. So the blacks are blacker, the energy consumption is a lot lower, and it's just overall a better display in terms of viewing angles as well. Now, this is an ash gray and copper accents. Uh, now, it does have the flipping hinge, so it goes into tent mode and can spin all around. Now, one of the great things is, is you notice that this is actually a huge trackpad, which is, feels really great, works really well. All the gestures are really great on it. Um, I much prefer this keyboard to what was on the previous generation just because it's a darker color. The silver on um, with the light lettering wasn't that great, but here is my favorite part of the machine. Take a look at that edging. So it has this great kind of ash brown gray and then this beautiful kind of copper accent on the side. So while we're here, we have the Windows button, volume rocker, there's a display port right in there full-size HDMI, two USB 3.0s, and a combined headphone jack. Now overall, I've always been a fan of the convertible form factor, and even more so with this really kind of unique look and feel. So just taking one last look around the other side, we have the PSU, a fan, another USB 3.0, and the power button, as well as an SD card reader. So this has just been a quick look at the, Ector, uh, the Spectre X360 13.3 inch notebook uh, with an HD OLED display and the option for Iris graphics now.